hello 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 you guys welcome back to my channel yeah so today's um video is based on a transformation i did on this black t-shirt yeah i transformed this shirt into a dress i also have two other transformation i did on two other shirts so if you want to see how i achieve all this please keep watching <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and take off the sleeves on this t-shirt. I won't be needing them for the next stage of this transformation. So I'll be taking off the sleeves of this t-shirt. And then once I am done with that, I'll go ahead to and open this t-shirt up. Because I just want to reshape them myself. I want to sew them in myself. So I'll be opening this up. And you, you just walk right out the door. Don't wanna do this anymore Now I'm lost without you You drive me crazy out my mind How'd you do this every time? Now I'm lost without you now placing my tape on my t-shirt, I want to chalk out 15 inches, that is my waist point, that is my half cut, it's either called half cut or waist point, yeah. So I want to know where 15 inches is because I'll be sewing that in with elastic so I can have that fitting on my waist. So chalking down 15 inches, once I'm done chalking down 15 inches, I'll be adding 3 extra inches to this because all those parts from where the 15 inches is to where the um, 3 extra inches stops I'll be sewing that place with elastic You, you just walk right out the door Don't wanna do this anymore Now I'm lost without you You Drive me crazy out my mind How'd you do this? So you guys, this is the elastic thread I'll be using to sew it in on my waist points Yeah, so this elastic is sold for just 15 era You just go to the market, ask for elastic thread And then 15 era, yeah, it's yours Okay, so now I'll be taking this to my machine now to sew this in And then I'll show you the results so I'm done sewing this in with my elastic. I'm done using my elastic on this from my waist point and then three extra inches. So I am done doing that. The next thing for me to do is to close the sides of the t-shirt. So I'm going to close them back. But before I do that, on the sleeves part where I had the sleeves where I took off my sleeves, I'll be hemming that in by half an inch. I'll be folding that in by half an inch. And once that is done, the next thing for me to do now is to close the sides and then I'll, be, I'll bring this back for you guys to see the results to you if you're watching me for the first time and you're not subscribed to this channel go right ahead and click on the subscribe button and subscribe to this channel so you can get notification whenever a new video is being uploaded and also um if you find this video interesting just give it a thumbs up before the video is done give it a thumbs up you can go right ahead and uh, comment on the comment section below if you want to or if you want to email me i'll be dropping that in the description box below with other social media platform i have so you can reach out to me if you want to um also if you want to share this video go right ahead and do that that would be a problem i had to cut out 10 inches long of organza and this is what i'll be using to pleat on my shirt um so using my office pin i'm going to be showing you guys how i pleated this on my shirt or my dress to be Okay, so the next part of this video this is the shirt will be transforming into a dress trust me it's going to be easy and quick so let's get right into it um we're going to be taking off the collar on this um shirt and after taking off the collar i'll go right ahead and take off the sleeves too for this next um transformation i need the sleeves so i'll just take them off right now and then i'll replace them back later so um once i'm done taking off the sleeves the next thing for me to do is you're so distant when you're home Always hanging by your phone Do I even know you? And I get paranoid sometimes Cause I know that you ain't mine And I'm lost without you You still be the one I talk to when I'm sad 
taking off the collar and the sleeves i am just going to go ahead and trim this off a bit and after doing that i'll be taking this to my machine to close in where we have that opening where the um, buttons were located before i want to close that in so i'll be taking this to my machine and i'll be closing that in all i'm trying to do right now i'm trying to trim this i'm trying to get the um the way i want this um, off shoulder to look like it's going to be an off shoulder dress i want it to look in a certain way so that's why i'm trying to trim up the upper part and also i'll go ahead and open the sides of the shirt i'm going to be opening them up then going back to the machine i'll be closing it up myself yep and you you just walk right out the door don't want to do this anymore now i'm lost without you you drive me crazy out my mind how'd you do this every time now i'm lost without you yeah before i take this to my machine to close the sides of the shirt i'm going to be hemming the upper part of this shirt by half an inch i always like to hem here because i like clean edges so i'll be taking this to my machine to hem the upper part of the shirt by half an inch and then i'll close the sides bringing back the results for you guys to see <laughs> So we'll be bringing back the sleeves we removed from the shirt now it's time for us to work on the sleeves so we're going to be bringing back the sleeves all i want to do right now is just to shape in it and have that box shape i want that box shape and then i'll be taking this to my machine to hem the up part and the down part of the sleeves and also using an elastic thread i'll be matching an elastic thread on the sleeve the upper parts i'll be matching like just two lines and then i'll be attaching this to my dress <laughs> transformation we are going to be doing this is the shirt we'll be using i'll be turning this into a dress quickly let's get into the video <laughs> be placing my ruler on this and then trimming this up in a planting motion i want to have an off shoulder dress so i don't need to detach anything i don't need to take off the pockets i don't need to take off the sleeves all i have to do is to have the, get that um round um off shoulder and once i'm done doing that too i'll be trimming off the sleeves i want a short sleeve so i'll be trimming off the sleeves and then i'll be taking my machine i'll be taking this to my machine sorry i'll be taking it to my machine i'll be hemming both the up part of the dress and also where the sleeves are <laughs> the door don't want to do this anymore now i'm lost without you you drive me crazy out my mind how'd you do this every time now i'm lost without you once i'm done hemming the upper part of this shirt and then on the sleeves i'm going to use my elastic like this same elastic thread i'm going to be sewing two to three lines on both the upper parts and on the sleeve so that i'll be taking to my machine to do you just walk right out the door don't want to do this anymore now i'm lost without you you drive me crazy out my mind how'd you do this every time now i'm lost without you you 
last part of this um, DIY you guys I'm just gonna be gathering a lot of fabric because I want to have a pleating on the base of my dress so I'll be gathering a lot of fabric I'll be joining them in my uh, with my machine and once I am done doing that I'm just gonna pleat this on the base of my dress and that is it you guys um, the DIY is done thank you very much for watching this video I really really appreciate you guys I love you so much I'll be seeing you on my next video bye